Mm -hmm. Yes. So hello, folks. Yeah. Oh, God. It is I, Kamikaze, here with Miss Illuminati. Why are you doing that voice? <laughs> because, for no apparent reason. Okay. We're here to play TikTok, a tale for two. Uh, apparently a uh, puzzle game. I'm going to attribute it similar to We Were Here series, which I've played. So I'm, I'm probably going to be far more aware of how things operate than she is. But I've never played this game and neither has she unless she's cheating. Nope. All right. So let's see here. So let's just jump right in. Two player adventure solo is not an option. Yeah, we gathered that. For best experience, <laughs> don't look at each other's screens. Well, it's kind of difficult from a distance, you know? Three time zones. Wait, does oh, it God. does it allow for... Calling through online chat, it's recommended that you use Discord. Oh, no. No, really? Mm. Um, two up players, two devices. So, are, do you want to be player one or player two? Uh, it's two. Two? Okay, then I'll click player one. Yes. I am player one. Make sure the team member is player two. Did you select that on your end? No. Thought we had to be in the lobby together. I don't know. I just clicked start game. It has very simple options. Okay, well, I will click. Oh, hold on. Good. Let me know when you're there. Start. Yep, I know all this. I already read it. Two. Okay. Okay, and then click start playing, I guess. And then maybe it'll make a... It says, today you and your friend received two strange packages. Each contained an old clock. I almost said an old cock. Mine almost. says something else. Oh, yours says something uh, Interesting. Sunday. You received a package. Oh. You received a package from someone called Emily Raven, and your friend got one too. Interesting. So, uh, dear player one, this clock is part of the game. A gift I made for my sister to have a fighting chance. Play with a friend and tell each other what you read and see. If you find, oh, there we go. If you find my sister, tell her I miss her. Amali. Amali? Amelie? Um, Amelie? Wait, I don't know. Oh, I wait, got a different down. one. The Dear Denmark. Player 2. Oh. No, go ahead. Can, go, go ahead and read. I sent one clock to you and one to your friend. If you want to play a game, look into the past together. Remember to wind the clocks up. Okay. okay and then I got oh. a box from Denmark that says another disappearance stry. <laughs> and a pocket watch that says a meal 1915 oh and i can turn the dial on it it did say wind your clocks up okay wind 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 da, 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 da. am i winding the right way oh i can open it <laughs> that's so stupid oh it's not open moving it. for me grab <laughs> oh oh grab oh, the thing and open right. it up am i moving yours no, am I moving yours? No. Are we even... How does this work? Because, I mean, we didn't even, like, join a lobby or anything. We just chose player one, player two. Does this actually play online? I don't know. Neither do I. All right, so... Another Wait, disparance. what did the paper... Oh, I'm sorry. Um, what did the says... paper in your box say? It says 10.30 at the very end. My paper says Tuesday, March 14th, 1937. Mine doesn't have a date. And then it says, well, it's cut off. It says, he's our village. <laughs> yeah. My youngest member of the Ng'd <laughs> clockmaker family was reported missing. Emil told us she heard at 1030. I'm trying uh, to get this watch. Oh, there we go. Grab the minute hand. So I already did that. To... Oh, I'm moving mine to 1030. So to. I should move mine to ten thirty. I don't know. No, mine's my my uh uh my newspaper said ten thirty on it. Mine doesn't have a date. Doesn't have a time. I mean a time. 
Uh, it has the date. It says, understandably distressed, she later corrected her statement and said it must have been an hour and a half later. If you have seen or heard anything unusual, please contact the police. If it's an hour and a half later, set yours to midnight. Okay. I'm estimating. I didn't do anything. So mine's at, like, I put it at 1030. Wait, or maybe mine at midnight. Oh, shit. I put mine at midnight. It sucked me in. You put it to midnight, then spin the dial. Okay. Oh, okay. We're going. <laughs> yeah, we're going. Chapter one. This is a copy I made of the world that Lark and I used to know. Lark went missing in 1937, but it all started years before. It just threw me back in time to 1927. Uh, uh, me too. Okay, <laughs> so like, it looks like we don't have to connect to each other to play. We just each have to select a player. And the information I have is what, I mean, you gave the hour and a half later, which means I changed it from 1030 to midnight. So it makes sense. It is working together. That's weird. I hey. think I've seen somebody play this, actually. This part looks familiar. Looks like a bus stop. I have no idea. Okay, so. There's a train on my. You can grab thing. the screen and rotate it. I've got a uh, bus stop, Raven's Clocks, uh, a well from the ring. Um, I have Raven's Clocks. A house. I have a well from the ring. <laughs> a house. Okay, let's see. So we have the same. Oh, you can click the well. I just clicked the well. I'm at the well right now, going down a ladder. So try clicking okay, the well. I'm on the ladder. Scroll down. Oh, what is this? What is that? It's a thingy. I see the thingy. What is the thingy? Okay, so I have three buttons. The top left, the bottom middle, and the top right. Wait, what? It looks like there's three buttons and three squares. I have the bottom left, the top middle, and the bottom right. Okay, that makes sense. So, what symbol is the top left for you? A dark triangle. <laughs> dark triangle, okay. So, the top middle one is like a magnifying glass, open magnifying glass. No. Open circle, whatever you want to call it. No. It's a dark square. No, no. <clears throat> it, it, your top oh, middle yours. one has a button. I have to change it. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. I was like, no, it's not. No, you're wrong. Okay. You're right. Sorry. I'm sorry. I told you this was going to make me feel stupid. That's the whole purpose of puzzles. Yeah. Okay. Now what? I tell you my top right. Tell me the top right. It's an open triangle. Open triangle. All right. And so the bottom left is an open square. Okay. <clears throat> the middle bottom is an open square. Okay. And the bottom right is a closed circle. Okay. Why did nothing happen? <laughs> okay, so let's make sure. From left to right it, on the top row is closed triangle, open circle, open triangle. Yep. Okay, so the bottom one is open square, open square, closed circle. Yep. Let's try and invert it. So whatever is okay. whatever no, is closed, good. open it. So the top left one for me, I'm going to change to an open triangle. And the top right one, I'm going to change to closed triangle. Oh, wait. No, sorry. You keep it like that. There's a lever on the side. Oh, I was like, right. what is this thing do? <laughs> what does this thing do? 
I didn't even notice the lever. See, you said you felt stupid, yet you turned around and, you know, did something smart. It opened. I to mess with random things. I was like, oh, it's this dude. That, that's, that's how you play the games. I got a elevator <laughs> button. I did too. Mine's a, like, a triangle. Mine points to the right. Mine too. Okay, so in this case, let's go to... Oh, go back to the bus stop. It's for that. <clears throat> okay. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay, so <laughs> next stop, let's go to the cock maker. <laughs> okay, it says opening hours 3 to 9. Does this... Okay, it's currently 11. Yeah. Wait, did it just go oh, back shun. in time? What? Huh. Well, let's go to the house then. Since we have to wait for the thing to open. Oh, it's got a little train. What do you see a train? Oh, is this a jack in the box? I don't like those. Do oh no, god! No, mine mine shows like a little steam engine train. Oh god! I'm doing it. I'm doing it. It gave me words. Please don't scare me. Please don't scare me. Boo! Please don't scare me. Please don't scare me. It's not gonna so scare you. This isn't a horror do. game. At least I don't think it's a horror game. But I have a little steam oh, engine god. going. I'm doing this. Why isn't it? What's is it this? making sound? Yeah. Oh shit. Oh, uh, hold on. No, no. I don't like it. It was making noise. Ugh. That's the only thing I can do. I have to do this. Don't be frightened of it. It is your destiny. I mean, I, I rotated mine in the direction that the arrows pointed, and it gave me words. Oh. I'm not doing it the right way then. Okay. You're doing it the opposite direction of the arrows? I was, and it didn't do anything. Oh, and then I turned on the, the lamp for the, the moth. Lark, mm -hmm. I hope you like your present. Turn it anti-clockwise three times, clockwise twice, anti-clockwise twice. Then keep turning it oh, clockwise. And do okay, not is that let for go. Me? That's for you. So... I got oh, shoot, information I for you. Open. So let go of it, okay. and then rotate it to the left three times, to the right twice, to the left twice, and then keep rotating it to the right until it's done. But never let go of the handle. Wait, three times to the left, to the right twice. Oh my god. <laughs> uh huh. What? I don't remember the other part. <laughs> it's left three, right two, left two, and then turn to the right continuously until it's done. I don't know if I did it right. Well, it would have done something if you did it right. I don't think I did it right. Do you know what counterclockwise is? <laughs> yes. Okay, counterclockwise three times. So do not let go of the handle. So let go okay. of the handle right now, and then start by holding the handle, then rotate it a complete circle three times to the anti-clockwise. Okay, did that. Now, while still holding it, move it clockwise twice in two circles. Okay. Now, do anti-clockwise two times. Okay. Now, keep turning it to the clockwise until it just says keep turning clockwise. Oh, God, it scared me. <laughs> Jesus, I told you I hate Jack and the Blinders. Okay, we got half a ticket. Half a ticket. Does the ticket say anything? Half. Zero, 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 six, seven. Okay, so oh, I That think... looks like a maze. <clears throat> yeah, I'm assuming that's going to have to do with the, um, uh, 
what do you call it? The uh, the train stop. But mm -hmm. I need it to be between the hours of 3 and 9 to access the Cox door. Okay. How do we make time pass? Um, switch the hands. How do you switch the hands? It won't let know. me change the hands. Can you grab the clock? Oh, did you leave? No, I didn't leave. Uh, well, I left that room, yes. Because we're done there. You got what you needed. Unless there was something else I could tell me. Yeah, there's nothing mm -hmm. else in this room for me. It's just a light bulb with a moth and the little train thing. So let's head over to the... Uh, what do you call it? The uh, train stop. Oh, oh! I can move the train on my screen at the train stop. Yes, so can I. But problem is, is that we don't have the entire answer for that. Oh, yeah. So what we need to do is it needs to be between the hours of 3 and 9. But how do we change the time? Mm -hmm. I'm not that smart. Well, we got to figure that out. Oh, oh, okay, I got it. So, when we move the entire screen to, like, one direction, it changes the hours. Mm -hmm. So, if we scroll to the right continuously, we can change the clock to be 3 o'clock. Like, I'm at 2 o'clock right now, and I'm just scrolling to the right. Oh. So then now that it's 3 o'clock, I go to the, the, the clock store. Yeah, I'm now in Raven's Clocks. Okay, hold on. I'm on two. I know, I'm waiting. Alright, I'm on there. And then just keep going until you get to the store. What? Oh. I'm done. Weren't, weren't. Okay. <clears throat> I'm in. All right, what do you see? I have a old-time radio. So do I. Mine says 525, 820, 1115, 1410, and 1705. Uh, uh, wait. Do you not have numbers on the dial? 525, 820. I think we have the same numbers. Okay. So... What was that on the ticket? Was ten thirty? Crap. I'll have to go back and look. Oh my god, if you move it around, it gives you words. What? If you move the dial. The ticket says zero 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 six seven. Zero 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 six seven. Huh. Yes. Okay, I guess that doesn't help. Okay, so let's let's start. Let's go with the, the radio. Move it until words come into place. Oh. Missing mostly old cats and dogs. Let's hope they're all found soon. Mine says last month the police started getting several reports of pets going, and then yours says what? Missing mostly old cats and dogs. Okay, let's so hope they are all found soon. So I have the first part, and you have the second part of these messages. So let's move yeah. on to the next one, and it says... The oldest raven... Oh, whoa, a, a bug just came down my... steps. The oldest raven daughter, Amelie, Am 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 is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her footsteps are usually followed by the ticking and scuttling of one of her creations. Yeah, I've got a little bug here. Oh, I can wind the Thank bug. You. Click the bug. Click the bug. Click the bug. Oh. <clears throat> okay, there he goes. Hi, bug. Okay, let's move on to the next one, which then says... The Raven family moved here a month ago and have worked day and night. <clears throat> to be able to open their clock shop today, the 18th. Okay, so it's the 18th. 
Yes. So they worked, they moved here yeah. a month ago and worked then open on the 18th. We don't know what, the 18th, I guess it's just a number we're going to have to remember. So 18. Um, let's move on to the next one. Another pet has been stolen during the night. This time it was Mrs. Jensen's. Sweet old farm dog. Remember to lock your doors until the thief has been caught. Okay, move on to the next one. A strange occurrence has shook our village. Droves of lifeless... Birds have been found scattered across the forest floor. You. Okay, yeah. Next one. I mean, free KFC, I mean... Hmm. No more walking for five miles to get your letters. It's now March and the... Construction of our very own post office will start at the end of the month. Okay, so... March 18th, I'm assuming. Let's move on to the next one, if there is one. One more, I guess. An unusual white raven seems attached to the youngest member of... Oh, shit. Raven family. Let's hope for her sake that it will not go missing like those other... Okay, so I think we have March 18th as the date. So, if we combine the two things to the train. How would that work? I have no idea. <laughs> so I'm assuming you have a train that is on a grid of six by eight at the train stop. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Okay. So we've got March sixteenth, uh, March eighteenth, and zero zero six seven. Yep. Okay. So March eighteenth. Mm. Uh. How would? Okay, I don't understand how that correlates to this, but I don't think there was any other things that we had was there okay because we, we did the house mm -hmm. we did the well mm -hmm. we did the cock shop so it's got to be something here so if we use the numbers like zero three one eight how would that go so if we go zero three Wait, 0318, if I move it all the way to the end and up. No, that doesn't make any sense. Because mm. it's not giving directions. So what does that train ticket look like, by the way? Or that ticket, whatever you had. It looked like a maze. <clears throat> Define the maze. Hold on. Oh, oh I'm so fucking dumb. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, I'm going back. Wow. I'm glad you said something. <laughs> Which one is this one? Okay. So it was. I did not take a picture of it to cheat. We go up. Up. Right. 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 Down. Down. Right. That's all I got. <clears throat> okay, so you got up, up, right, 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 down, down, right. Yeah. Okay. And that's all the ticket has it cut off. So is it cut off on the left or cut off on the right? The right. Okay, so you have the start of the maze. Yes. 
Okay, maybe I have the end of the maze somewhere because it sure wasn't here. You got that from... The jack-in-the-box in the house. Okay, <clears throat> and... I'm trying to see if there's anything else here. I mean, I've got a moth, but that doesn't help. I'm checking the house to see if there was anything. I can't stop the train. And no, it just gives me instructions for your jack-in-the-box. Mm. I'm gonna check the well again real quick. Nothing here. What did you say you have had in the house? Uh, it was the, the train, like, little thing that I had to make turn to make smoke to give me words that gave you the solution to your jack-in-the-box. Uh oh I'm going back into mm. Raven's box. So what we had was... Essentially, something has to do with March 18th. Oh, oh! Uh, in that house, you can scroll up and down. What? Go back to the house. Scroll up and down. Yeah, grab it and scroll up and down. Mine doesn't do that. Yours doesn't? No. I grabbed the stairs and, like, pulled down, and it let me go up. So hold on. Uh, oh, oh, that house. Sorry. Wait. You mean the, With the shop? Radio. Oh yeah, That's the sorry, shop. the shop. Damn it! What is it saying? Oh, okay. And there, <clears> was a, <throat> there was a calendar all the way at the top. Okay, I'm gonna do the shut up. Okay. I don't have a calendar at the top, but I have a news article. Oh, what does it say? News Wednesday edition. In Raven's Clock Shop, you can buy all kinds of clockwork, request commissions, and get your old clock repaired. You just Today, grand me opening. Was... She just reminded me that it was the 18th, not the 16th. Oh so my... it opened up, and I got the other half of the, the, the ticket. Ah, uh, it says today grand opening of clock shop. The world reowned clockmaker Mr. Blank. The level of detail is exquisite. Our own Raven has opened a clock shop in our something queen is said to have a couple of of his town. Okay, so um He is said to be an in interesting char elegant pieces today he is opening his. <laughs> That's what I got. Okay, well, all I needed was the date. It reminded me of the date where I said March 18th earlier, and I put 16th because I'm an idiot. Um, but I have the other half the ticket. So, go to the bus stop. Okay, let me get back down. <sighs> and put in what you have. And then put I'll give you the rest of it. You have the first half the ticket, remember? Yeah, I already have it in there. Okay, and so now you go up. Up, up. Wait. What? No, it was only two up. No, no, no. I'm giving you the end of the solution. Oh, sorry. Up, up. Okay. So, that was three ups. Yep. Right, right. Up right. Woo! It clicked. Okay, now I have to get there and do it on mine. So up, up, up. Right, right. Up, right. Ching! Ah, the train showed up. If you zoom out. Oh. Oh, I clicked on it. So did I. 
chapter two. But we're going to call this episode here before we continue because this is a good place to end it. So if you folks are enjoying this, please, you know, do the normal things. And we'll catch you in the next time of the Illuminati Files as we play. I oh, sorry. I did it too soon. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's fine. You want to do it now? I still haven't hit and stopped recording yet. Oh, <laughs>